They coming, they coming, they coming. Hit the button, hit the button. Young world, and as we all know and always have known, the bullshit never stops. So Judge Joe Brown was on the Dr. Boy's walking show. They sitting there talking about all type of stuff. You know, when Judge Joe Brown started talking, he'll talk at, he'll just talk nonstop for about 20, like, the Joker would just keep talking nonstop for like a whole hour straight if you let him, but he'd be just dropping massive bombs one after another. Boom, boom, bang, boom, up this mad stuff inside you. He'd be sitting there like, I gotta fact check this stuff because he'd be saying so much stuff that just seems, you know what I'm saying? It's just enormous. Like stuff you would think, like, if this is true, how come nobody else ain't never said, I never heard it before? Like, it's not already a big deal on top of every damn newspaper, every online website. How come people ain't talking about this shit already? Is what you be thinking. So here he goes again. But what he said now is what I've been saying, and people like me have been saying for years. You can go back to my last channel years ago, the original one. I have been saying Barack Obama, Brad Pitt, um, George Bush. Madonna, Queen Elizabeth, all these people are related. I've been saying this for many, many years. So Judge Joe Brown mentions the actual ancestor who these jokers all come from. The actual person. His name is Samuel Hinckley from Cape Cod. At least he settled in Cape Cod in Massachusetts. He said he, Barack Obama, both of the Bushes, of course, the father and the son, Brad Pitt, Dick Cheney, and others all come from the same exact dude. He said this dude, Sam Hinckley, is related to seven presidents and one vice president. So when people say stuff like this, I've made these videos before. I made a video showing how the Joker, Trump, and Hillary Clinton have a common ancestor going back to, I forget, but the, but the queen of whoever, her, I forget where it was or what her name was, but I dug that shit up years ago on my original channel. And that was when I first... No, like started having weird stuff on my YouTube when I started talking about um, Trump and Hillary Clinton being related that was when I, my shit first started scrambling around on my original channel first started acting mad weird is when I came on the, the, the radar of the beast of the machine so I, I pointed that out but he, he, he mentioned the dude the answers that he's all, all related to this dude like I said, when you when I say something from the past, people go, oh, just because they're related, a common ancestor seven times removed, that's a coincidence, it could be anybody. Blah, blah, blah. But if you have one joker who's related to seven U.S. presidents and one U.S. vice president, it's too much to be a goddamn coincidence. At that point, it's not a coincidence, it's a conspiracy. So, stuff like this for me is proof of to why I feel the way I feel, but why I'm dignified and vilified and feel confident feeling the way I feel about how I feel, see the, the, the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't mind that water in the back. That's my washer going off. But that's why I feel the way I feel. And that's why I stand on what I stand on. Stuff like this. So he names the ancestor of Samuel Hinckley. You can dig it up yourself. Look more into it like yourself. Like I just did before I made this video. And this is the Joker I've been talking about for years without knowing who he was or what his name was. So he, Dr. Joe, Judge Joel Brown dug up the actual ancestor who these jokers all come from and what makes it a little bit more weird and creepy is the joker samuel hinkley died on halloween day so that's a little bit more makes it a little bit makes it just a tiny bit more fucking weird